Right, we're now going to look at 2007 Sida. 07, another one of the Capes, really good vintages. The winter of 06, cold and wet, long winter, mild summer, and really there was, at the appropriate time, things sort of warmed up substantially, but no, no prolonged period of, of excessive heat. So we could ripen fruit over a long period of time. And I mean, many of you have heard of this term, hang, hang time. 07 gave us just an extra few days of hang time that we could really ripen fruit well without excessively high alcohol. So um, these grapes also originate from one specific block in the Yonkersuk Valley on a slightly warmer slope. It's probably more northwest facing, which gets a lot of afternoon sun. Vineyard, uh, by our standards, sort of in its prime, we're looking at a 20 year old vineyard. But uh, on arrival at the cellar, I mean, this would obviously, because we have expectations for this block, everybody tends to be quite excited when it comes in. So, so typically it gets the royal treatment. These grapes would go through a series or would be fermented in open fermenters and typically go through a series of daily punch downs. Um, and again, we'd find a percentage of the, of the wine or, or partially fermented must finish in fermentation in new French oak. And a portion would be retained on skins and kept on skins for an appropriate period, which could be anywhere as much as an extra 10 to 20 days, depending on vintage, and then taken straight to barrel to complete paleolactic fermentation. But uh, these are wines that show a lot, again, a lot of dark fruit, um, hints of plum. There's also sort of hints of violet, white pepper, black pepper, and very, very appropriate oaking. I mean, the oaking when young is, is there, but it tends to integrate incredibly well. And this style of wine is probably never a forceful wine because what we do find and what we particularly aim for is wines that have well-integrated grape tannin, well-integrated oak tannin, and uh, these are all very, very neatly framed. And obviously the finish, what's important to us, as although the wines are dry, there's a wonderful fruit sweetness about them. And that uh, we believe is sort of very much in character with that particular vineyard. Mm -hmm. 